We begin this afternoon with those loud protests that unfolded all night outside of Pittsburgh Mayor Bill Peduto's home. Police finally broke it up this morning, and just a short time ago, Mayor Peduto responded. Lindsay Ward has the latest details on a tense night in Point Breeze. It's much quieter here along Hastings Street in Point Breeze. Protesters left a little after 10 o'clock this morning. They were visibly upset when they left and plan on coming back tonight. Police showed up and said they had to leave. If not, they could be arrested. Around 930 this morning, a line of Pittsburgh police officers stood together near Mayor Bill Peduto's home, declaring this gathering a, quote, unlawful assembly. Only about a dozen protesters were there, and 30 minutes later, they all left peacefully, and no one was arrested. Earlier, the protesters were setting off a loud siren and were using a megaphone. They were trying to get the mayor's attention, requesting to talk to him. Jesse Seeger is co-owner of Point Bruges Cafe, a restaurant just steps away from the activity. It was uh, certainly loud. I'm sure it was a lot worse for the neighbors who were on this block. He says at one point, around 300 people were on the street, and some even spent the night. You can see mattresses on the sidewalk. Seeger says he wasn't worried about the situation getting out of hand. And everything uh, seemed to be pretty, uh, um, pretty harmonious. But he was concerned for those who live close to the mayor's house. There are definitely neighbors that are scared. I've talked to multiple neighbor, neighbors that left for the evening that have kids, that have uh, elderly people in the house. The massive protest started Tuesday evening. It wasn't until 7.30 when they showed up in front of the mayor's house. This is the second time in just days protesters showed up in front of his place. Many of them tell KDKA they feel the mayor does not support their movement. They're also angry for what happened to protester Matthew Cartier. He was arrested last weekend in Oakland by plainclothes officers. Reporting in Point Breeze, I'm Lindsay Ward, KDKA News. Mayor Peduto released a statement on the protests within the last hour. He says while he strongly believes that Black Lives Matter and its right to take to the streets and demand reforms, he can't defend people harassing and threatening neighborhoods throughout the night and morning. He goes on to write anyone committing crimes against residents will face possible legal consequences for their actions. You can read the mayor's full statement on our website, kdka.com.